After 33 years in the business, Betty West has experienced firsthand the various iterations of Grand Cadoument. This year, one of the major changes was the starting point for the street parade, which shifted to the helipad car park in Bridgetown. Ms. West says the feedback from masqueraders has been positive. I spoke to a good few of my band members and they really liked it. We had good view and they really liked it because I want for the, for the, the original route, you know, coming from the stadium and so on. So I generally wait to hear from my, my band members. Like when we went on the highway, they was calling and saying, we don't want to go there again. But yeah, and yesterday, this morning, I, a few of them called me to congratulate me. And they said, it's long, they say it's long. <laughs> they enjoy it, so. Similar sentiments are shared by band leader of Vida by Esquire, Ryan Ford. I think a lot of the revelers, they um, were extremely pleased with the, with the route uh, because the width of the road at the beginning, it was good. It was a tight squeeze from the start. We do know some roads do get a little tighter like when you get down um, Eagle Hall site or, or, or into Black Rock or whatever because obviously more of the community is there. Uh, so I think from the Ravelers perspective, it was a nice start coming out of Bridgetown and across Pelican Village and, and whatnot. The band leaders were also asked their thoughts on the two-hour postponement of the start time to 11 o'clock. People think that it was MCS, but the, we, we agreed, we agreed. They asked the questions and we agreed because everybody was worried about the, uh, about the weather. It actually worked out that we didn't have any wastage from the breakfast because almost every single person was able to get there for breakfast. And that is positive because then you have a good foundation and ready to go. And then you also have your numbers with you before you get to the first judges. Despite the challenges securing sponsorship and late registrations, Betty West Productions received several awards, including Large Band of the Year in the Heritage category, and the George Deere Award for Best Band on the Road. Vida by Esquire, only in its second year, was adjudged the Large Party Band of the Year and the Party Band with the Best Presentation. Both band leaders were happy with the results. Sharika Griffith, CBC News.